Hello fellow paranormal enthusiasts, welcome to Paranormal Hoaxes, Lake George Monster. In 1904, at Hag Bay in Lake George in northeastern New York, artist Harry Watrous made a bet with Colonel William D. Alton Mann, who fought at Gettysburg, to see who could catch the largest fish. Later on, the colonel showed Watrous a 40-pound trout he caught. A defeat of Watrous had lost the bet, but a few days later came to the realization that the colonel's fish was a fake. So Watrous decided some revenge was in order. He created a large sea monster made out of cedar. It had a large mouth, pointed ears, green eyes, made from telegraph pole insulators, and it was painted black and yellow. Watrous took it to the lake for testing, and he was successful. Now he just had to wait for Colonel Mann. On a fateful Saturday, Mann and his friends arrived to hop in the boat, and as they were boating around, Watchers had the monster arise from the water and shake its head to look more realistic. The man party was stunned. Watchers then decided to prank other onlookers, and several stories came about of the Lake George monster. But, a few years later, it was proven a hoax. And in the world of cryptozoology, this is one of the most well-known and talked-about hoaxes. Well, thank you guys so much for watching my Paranormal Hoaxes video. I hope you enjoyed it, and as always, subscribe for more paranormal activity, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.